at night, melatonin is in charge, right? So it's busy repairing your DNA, calming inflammation, and restoring your mitochondria so that your body can heal while you sleep. But here's the catch. By morning, melatonin needs to drop so that cortisol can rise. Cortisol gets such a bad rap online. Everyone calls it the stress hormone and talks about cortisol face, but in reality, it's your daytime on switch. And when that morning cortisol surge happens like it's supposed to, it flips on your metabolism. That's when your body knows, okay, it's time to burn energy and not store it. You're gonna wake up with steady energy, you'll burn more fat efficiently, your blood sugar will stay stable, and your workouts actually work better. But if melatonin hangs around too long and cortisol can't rise, your metabolism stays stuck in night mode, right? And that's when you're feeling groggy, you're craving all the sugars, and instead of burning fat, your body's holding on to it. So if weight loss has felt harder than it should, this handoff between melatonin and cortisol might be the missing piece.